We can get to documentation from the MATLAB ODE suite by entering this command at the MATLAB prompt, doc ODE45. This will bring us to uh, extensive documentation for MATLAB ODE45 that includes, among other things, this chart that compares MATLAB ODE solvers. There are seven of them, um, and this compares their various attributes. Uh, as we've said before, MATLAB ODE45 is the workhorse. It's a non-stiff solver with uh, medium accuracy that is the first one you should try and use it most of the time. I have a soft spot in my heart for MATLAB ODE23. It's a non-stiff solver with low accuracy, but it's accuracy that's appropriate for graphics work because it chooses, the step size it chooses are, uh, is appropriate for most graphics work. MATLAB uh, uh, ODE113, we haven't talked about it yet. There should be a comma between the, there could be a comma between the 1 and the 13 here because this is a variable order method where the order varies all the way from 1 to 13. It's a multi-step method that saves history. It's, um, if you know about these things, it's an Adams, um, Adams Moulton method. Um, I associate this with work done at Jet Propulsion Laboratory years ago for computing um, orbits of uh, planets and satellites, which of course are very smooth and go on for years. It can uh, uh, have very high accuracy requirements. Then there are the stiff solvers. Uh, there are four of them, uh, 15S, 23S, and the, 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 the twins, the trapezoid rules. Um, 15S is the primary stiff solver. Uh, low, to medium accu low to medium accuracy. It's your first, if you find ODE45 is slow, taking lots of steps, indication that the problem is stiff, try 15S. Uh, 23S can be as a low order method, low accuracy, and used at uh, crude error tolerances. We haven't talked about uh, mass matrices. Uh, this is where there's a matrix in front of the um, derivative term. And this can be used with constant mass matrices. And then the two uh, routines with T's in their name are based on the trapezoid rule. And uh, they're for use with um, problems without any numerical damping. Uh, you can uh, see the documentation for uh, more details on the trapezoid methods. That's the MATLAB ODE suite, uh, seven solvers, uh, three for non-stiff problems, and uh, four for stiff problems. Um, you may well get through uh, with never using anything, but uh, ODE 45 may well uh, serve all your needs. There's a second chart in the documentation that uh, summarizes all the options that are available through the ODE set function. Uh, we've briefly mentioned the tolerances, RELTOL and ABSTOL, uh, the output function. Um, these are available for in all seven of the uh, solvers. There are various other functions, various other options available for more specialized work, including event handling, uh, providing a Jacobian to the um, stiff solvers so they don't have to work so hard taking numerical differences. Uh, 
options associated with the mass matrices, uh, providing a limit on the step size. These are all uh, options that can be uh, uh, specified through ODE set for more uh, specialized work with the uh, ODE solvers.